okay uh, let's try to solve this let's try to solve this problem and uh, diversity so let's read this problem statement first and the problem statement is that there are any student in a school school class uh, the rating of the ith student on code horses is ai you have to form a team consist of k student and such a rating of all team members are distinct so you 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 have to form a team consist of k student and their rating all teams are must be distinct so so we have given any students and you have to pick the k k student uh, such that the rating of all students are distinct so if it is impossible to form a suitable team pin no otherwise pin yes and then k distinct number you have to pin the k distinct number which should be indices of the student in the team you form so you have to print a k distinct indexes uh, numbers indices if the answer is yes and if there are multiple answer you print any of them okay so there are any possible you can print any so let's try to understand with the example so in that we have to pick the three distinct okay we have to pick three distinct so in this is the first fifteen with index one and we can pick 13 with index 2 and then 2 1. We can pick index 5. So that will be the answer because we have picked three elements and which are distinct. And there are multiple answer possible. We can pick 15 from the index 3 and from index 4 and from index 2. So uh, index 1. So we can pick uh, 15 from any index 1, 3, 4 and it will always make the three distinct. So here we have to make four distinct, but we have only one, two, three. Only three distincts are there. We can't make it, so we have to print no. In that question, we have four distinct, and we can pick uh, index one, two, three, four. So you can pick any indexes here. See that uh, any possible answer for the first one, one, two, five, two, three, five, and two, four, five. So there are multiple possible answers are there. Okay. So how to solve this question? And definitely, uh, you can solve this question usually. Uh, using map STL part. Okay, even even uh, this problem can be easily solved by a set, but the problem is that we have to store the index too. So through index, you can using the map. Map, uh, what we do, we actually use a map and this key value has integer and the value is integer. We will store something like a, a map 15 and the index i plus one. So because it is a zero base, so you can print uh, the i plus one index. So whenever, whenever actually we are getting the first 15, so we are i plus one. So m of 15 will become index one, okay? And when you get encountered another 15, you, the index will improve and the index will update it and it will become one, two, three, three, this index, okay? Because they're multi, they're, uh, you can print any answer, okay, which is suitable. So it will be very easy to uh, solve this question using map. So let's try to implement the code. You can implement your own and so here is that we have seen N and seen K. I have a declaration all global values. So that's why we have taken input directly. And after that, I'll just use map LLL. Okay. What is LL is? LL is my long log int. Okay. LL is long log int. So that is our macro and I have defined here. So you can check. So here, uh, every input, I less than n, i plus plus. So what, what we did every input. So seen x and we are x equal to i plus one. That's it. And now we are checking if m dot size is checking is less than k. If it's less than k, you have to print c out no and then and else. Okay. There are multiple chances. There are chances that uh, map contain uh, much bigger than uh, k element. So you have to print c out yes and you have to print k times i equal to zero. Uh, or you can write uh, for auto x and map and we have to print c out x dot second okay and you can print something like if k is greater than zero you have to print c out x dot second 
and this part, okay? And after that, you have to do k minus minus. So k is equal to zero. So this is the way that you can do. So here the answer is two, three, two, four, five. Two, four, five is our answer. And you see that ocean in the in that question. We have two, four, five is a one possible answer because the fifteen you can choose any one. And if it is less than k, that means a uh, map contain less than k elements. So you have to print no. This is the way that you can do. See this. So we print like two one four three. That is the answer. Five two four because ah uh, it is actually map contain the sorted order like so twelve comes first. Then but the answer is correct. Okay, answer is correct because you can't ah uh, let's see. If I print in any order, uh, any order, you can print any order. So order is not a problem. So let's try to submit. So our code become accepted. Let's mark it. 